Well, have you ever heard of an island overrun by pot belly pigs in the middle of nowhere in the south of Thailand? If you haven't, then you're in luck because that is exactly where we are right now. We have just arrived in Koh Mad Sum, which most people know as... Big Island. <laughs> and it gets its name, obviously, from a lot of pigs. So I think the story goes, originally someone brought over... A couple of pigs, I'm not sure exactly I think many. around 12, and now they have reproduced and reproduced. Um, but the island just kind of lives with them and mm. chills out. So we are very, very excited to go and pet some. We're going to take you back to this morning when we just started on the boat, and then we'll meet you back in a minute. Good morning everyone from a nice bright and early morning in Koh Samui. <laughs> We're just waiting to get picked up as we have booked a tour to see some of the best things to do in Koh Samui. So we're rushing breakfast because it's literally waiting for us now. <laughs> It's going to attack you. That's not enough for it. <laughs> Move your finger. Just destroy it. Just ripped it off. I don't like that one. <laughs> Yet again, we found another animal that I'm terrified of. Pigs, apparently. I don't know what it is. We've just wild animals here in Asia. That just makes me really scared. But they keep fighting each other and like ripping food out of people's hands. Oh, look at them. So fat. <laughs> He's not hungry. Totally hungry. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Aiden, what's it like looking in the mirror? Aiden's gonna feed the big pig. <laughs> oh, look at that speed. You've made a friend. It's actually looking at you. It does look very intelligent with its eyes. I lost the plate because I was getting bullied by some pigs, so I've only got a little bit left. <laughs> yeah, so you're not supposed to feed them by your hand because they can bite you, so you're supposed to put it on a plate and on the ground or just pull this onto the floor. <laughs> it's only 50 baht for a big bag of this feed, so relatively cheap. Oh, that one was cool. <laughs> oh, you're tickling it. <laughs> 
it is um, of course very touristy here there's lots of boats turning up people kind of crowding around the little um, baby ones because they're the cutest and make for the best pictures but there are plenty of pigs to go around they're literally everywhere in fact there's one underneath the table we're sat at right now just chilling <laughs> We spoke to our hostel about the best way to get here and they told us the best way is to just book a tour. So in total it costs us 1,400 baht each for the boat here and back. I'm sure you can just go to any pier and speak to some fishermen and they can probably pay a lot less for transport here but we just decided it would be easier to book a, a tour. There's also um, some more that you can do on the island. Obviously the pigs are the main attraction, but there's a small little um, kind of shack with drinks and food. There's also a lot of people swimming in the water, which looks really beautiful. And I think you can pay extra and do a bit of kayaking, but obviously we have already done that. If you would like to see how our kayaking went really, really wrong, then you can watch um, our video. We will link it down below. hanging on this beautiful island now for quite a while had our lunch let it go down and now we're heading on the boat for some snorkeling you excited very much so. i'm tired is what i am the sun takes it out of me but i'm ready to see some beautiful fish get a shower we couldn't finish anything off after the end of the snorkeling because we both had a little bit of a panic um, we both managed to kick the coral on the floor obviously accidentally and everyone knows it's really sharp so we both Cut ended up feet. scraping our feet at different points of the snorkeling so yeah a lot of blood a lot yeah. of <laughs> had to get straight back kind of showered um, assess the wounds we're okay it's okay we're I don't fine. think they we're were poisonous fine. either hopefully not <laughs> Yeah, so we just wanted to finish this video um, not on a bad note. Let's finish it on a good note. We had, what, a really good day? Yes, it was great. Yeah, it was great. One of the best. I would highly, highly <laughs> recommend this if you're staying in Costa Marie. It's an easy 45 minutes, hour boat. Um, if you do it with a tour, it's all included. So yeah. that's why I would say it's easiest for us, definitely. 
So this was absolutely one of my highlights of being on this island. It was a once in a lifetime opportunity to hang out on this tiny island with these amazing pigs and then to go snorkeling and as well, it was great. And the island was so beautiful, beautiful. like in itself, just to go to this kind of untouched paradise was amazing and a memory that we will definitely not forget. No way. So that's all from us now. Thank you very much for watching this video. And if we can just add to, if you have just a second, leave a comment, write something that you thought was funny or something that annoyed you. We don't care, we'll try and reply. <laughs> and if you have time, just like and subscribe. It helps us reach as many people as we can. We really want everyone to join our kind of travel community, give tips to others, so yeah. If you can, just give us a little like to help us out and we will see you again next time. Bye. Bye.